Hi everyone, welcome back. If you're new, welcome. So in today's video, I'm going to share with you guys my current beauty faves. I feel like a lot of this is mainly hygiene items and like maybe hair items. So if you guys are interested, make sure you guys stay tuned because a lot of you have been asking for my current beauty faves, my current hygiene faves, and I'm here to share it with you guys. Okay, so the first thing, lotion. This is actually empty. This is my Jergens lotion. Now, every single time I buy a Jergens lotion, I always buy a different kind. So I'll be like, I'll buy the Ultra Healing this time, and then I'll buy like the Soft Skin next time, and then I'll dry, buy like the Ultra Repair the next time. So this one, I have the Jergens Ultra Healing Repairs and Heals Extra Dry Skin with Vitamin C's, C's, C E and B5. So this is for extra dry skin. Now I felt like the lower half of my leg so from the knee down to the ankle it was just like so dry so i was like i need this and it worked i feel like my skin really got back to how it used to be and how it looks i swear by jergens i need to work with jergens because i've been using them for years the jergens was like always in our household when i was growing up and then i was just like it's actually good jergens is like the perfect consistency it's worth your money now jergens is a little bit more on the thicker side i would say this is really good for people who don't mind thicker lotions so if you're someone who likes some more watery thinner lotions maybe jergens is not for you but I like it, it's worth it, very affordable. Jurgens, they have a whole line of lotions to treat a specific need that's need, so you can definitely like check them out and see what lotion that would be tailored perfectly for your skin. I'm going to try and link all the products that I share in this video in the description if I can find it. If I can't, I'm just gonna list exactly what store I got product from, okay? So the next item that I have, super simple, super basic, it's funny, but it's this hard bristle brush, okay? Been loving it, been using it lately because I feel like when it comes to doing natural hair, the best products for your hair are the most like simple, basic, staple that we've been using, we all have been using, and it's a hard bristle brush. So if you need to slick back your hair, you need to make your hair look sleek and nice, hard bristle brushes, they just tie everything all together. So if you have natural hair like me, like hair type similar to me, you would need a a hard bristle brush Ooh, a hard bristle brush this one's more on the smaller side and you can get these at the beauty supply store now i have a whole entire video on beginner's kit for natural hair and i share with you guys like all the things you can get at a beauty supply store for beginners so you guys definitely watch that video i love that video it needs more views i only have 100 views on it i got this anyway the video is actually so good so you guys go watch it i really like this this brush works and it's like a dollar two dollars so Go get it, local beauty supply store. If I can try and link a similar from Amazon, I'm going to give it to you guys. Trust me, it's sleeks, it's slicks, it's so cheap, why not, right? Okay, so the next thing I'm going to talk about is a staple. It's a current staple, it's always gonna be a current fave and staple of mine, and it's a whitening kit. I'm not gonna tell you guys which brand that I use. The reason for that is because I hear I heard that they're scamming people and they're taking people's money and not sending them their product. And they they literally don't have a customer service. Like they'll reach out to the customer service and they'll take like 20 30 days to respond or they won't respond at all they don't answer their calls or anything like that so i wouldn't recommend this brand but i would recommend you guys buying a whitening kit because it's going to whiten your teeth and when your teeth are white it enhances your appearance and it makes you look so good just get any whitening kit that you guys can find and that's what i use i always make sure that i try to white my teeth i haven't whitened my teeth for like years now like three four years and it's still going strong but i feel like it's starting to get yellow again so i just started like yesterday so it's a current fave and I love it. So get any whitening kit, I swear by it. Ever since I got introduced to this product and I've been using it, I was like, I bet you this is what they use at like whitening teeth, estheticians that whiten your teeth and stuff like that. I'm like, I bet you this is what they use because it whitened my teeth and changed my appearance. And the reason why I like this whitening kit because you can do it at your time, your own pace, at home, you, you pay for a whitening kit once and you can use it whenever you want, how many times you want, and it goes by your pace. You don't always have to book appointments, leave your house, go somewhere, have someone whiten your teeth for a long time, and you keep on spending all this money. And you can just buy your own, your own whitening kit at home and whiten your teeth. I swear by it, love it. Guys, the white teeth will change your life. Okay, so my next current beauty fave, well, more on the hygiene side, is this Dove Fresh 24-Hour Invisible Solid deodorant. Now, I know it's for years now. I don't even know, it's been years, like, long. I can't even tell you the length, like, 10 years or more. I noticed that I always gravitate and I always use Dove deodorants. I feel like their deodorants are so soft and they always smell good and they just work for me. So this one is the 24 hour invisible solid fresh, so it's invisible. So whenever you put this on, then you put on a shirt, it won't appear on your shirt. I like it, so that's why I got it. And I've used like a, an array of different Dove deodorants. I swear about all of them, I like all of them. It just depends on what I want to buy. Once one is finished, I'm just like, I go back into the store and I'm like, hmm. What am I going to try this one? Let me let me get this one. Let me get this one. Let me get this one. And I just try all of them. They all work for me. So I like the fact that I can play around with different Dove deodorants and they still all work really well for me. And again, this is an invisible one, so I don't have to worry about deodorant lines on my shirt, which do happen a lot actually to me. So this you can also get at Walmart. Super affordable. And these products actually last a long time. All of these are basically still not done except like the Jurgens lotion. That one is finished. 
okay i feel like i've shown this on my channel a lot and i mentioned it a lot so this is the formula 10.06 now I, I used to remember i always saw this brand in walmart and i never picked it up and i finally did and it works it's fine it's very nice i love the branding and everything so this is a skin detoxing peel mask and charcoal plum and basically you put it on okay I usually I mainly use it around my nose because I feel like my pores on my nose are a little bit bigger and it gets clogged more and oil and everything like that. So you're supposed to put it on your nose and then make it dry and then peel it off and it's supposed to draw out like all the impurities out of your pores and sometimes you can actually use this like as like exfoliator as well. So honestly I only use this on my nose because that's where I'm that's my problem here. This was I think three dollars at Walmart. I cannot remember about this a, a few months ago, but it's still a current fave. And it works well. Okay, so the next thing is a hair care product as well. So this is the Dove Damage Therapy Intense Repair Shampoo. Okay, I've been using this a lot because this is what I just have in my house, number one, <laughs> currently. And not only that, my hair is damaged. I feel like the ends of them are damaged because I bleached it and all my bleached hair is now on the ends of my hair because my hair grew it all out. So I've been using this a lot and again, I can't go wrong with the products, they work, they're fine, it's good, it's affordable, I like it. Okay, I feel like there's a conditioner with it, I don't have the conditioner, but I have another Dove conditioner that I use with my hair. I like it, I'll give this like a 7 out of 10, it's really good, it's a current fave. I can't go wrong with Dove, I don't have nothing negative to say about Dove. Now, my holy grail fave, my staple, is something that I cannot live without besides my teeth whitening kit, is my Olay Daily Facials Cleansing. My cleansing cuts, guys. This ever since I got introduced to this to remove my makeup, I never used any product ever again, ever again. And I noticed with oil, actually, there's another Olay um, product. It's like a cream product. It like takes off all your makeup. That's another favorite of mine. I show how to use this product more in depth in my skincare, like removing my makeup videos. All you have to do is add water to the cloth, and it takes off your makeup completely clean. And I just go in with like what two more products, like soap and a little bar soap, and it my makeup's gone. So. I started this so affordable, I'm gonna link it and I want you guys to try this out too because once you guys use this, you're, if you like cloths, if you like cloths, okay? And if you don't like cloths, I, I cloth, I would say use the Olay, I cannot remember it. I'm going to link it in the description and basically it's like a cream if you're more into creams instead of cloths because I know some people are not really into cloths. So you just put the cream on your face and it breaks down your makeup and all you have to do is wipe off the cream off your face or wash off and then wash off your face right after. Miracles or Olay products when it comes to makeup removers. I recommend really like this Removes dirt oil makeup and even mascara two times better than the basic cleaning and it's true I honestly agree and so soft. It's not hard You don't have to be tugging at your skin and pulling your skin and scrubbing your skin just to take off the product Like you lightly put the cloth on your face and all your products all the makeup comes off But yeah, that's it for today's video. These are my current beauty hygiene faves <laughs> And I wanted to share it with you guys. So let me know what your current beauty or hygiene fave. Oh, and hair care faves. Basically all beauty items in the comment section. I want to see what your guys' current things. Have you guys tried any of these? What do you guys think? Let me know. Give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Or